It stopped. Is Zack okay? Iron bars are unlocked. Zack, you okay? Zack? Hey. What the hell took you so long? A little longer and a drop of my piss could have powered the world for a thousand fucking years! So you're alive. Ding, ding, ding! What do we have for her, Johnny? Thank goodness. I wouldn't know what to do if you died. Stupid! As if I'd die so easy. Incredible. <laughs> yeah, I'm still t lifeless with that. <laughs> Simply incredible. He survived. I knew it. It's the resilience of murderous monsters that makes them so alluring. Oh, what an exemplary and perfect specimen you are, Zack. To tell the truth, I'd hope to witness the very moment that life leaves your body. Seeing her work so hard has convinced me to be nice this time. You may pass through. Besides, punishment for one's sins is not a one-time thing. What must be punished for as many sins committed? Isn't that lovely? Oh, go suck an egg, crazy. You sadistic bitch! That stupid ass chuckle of yours pisses me off. If you weren't hiding safely behind that monitor, I'd have sliced you up good. Hey, give me that back. Okay. What the what the fuck is this? There's some kind of junk all over it. I used it to cut the heads off the dolls. What are you? Some sort of doll killing psychopath? What the hell were you doing? It seems the mechanism had to do with the dolls as gaze, so I made them face away from you. You use my scythe for some weird shit and I turn it into an electric eel. That's just one damn thing after another. It's half your own fault. Shut it! It's you who needs to be more careful. Let's get going. So, uh, hey everybody. My name is Demonic One and welcome back to more Angel of Death. <laughs> yeah, late on the intro there. But hey. We're getting there. It's a door that says extreme caution. I'm guessing a gas chamber? Hey, what the hell are you doing? Doors are made to be walked through. It looks dangerous. We're not gonna get anywhere if you're chicken shit. I think we need to be more careful considering what happened earlier. What's through this one? The door is locked. It's locked. Hey, open up! There's no response. Shit. It's that woman. She's probably spying on us right now. So, Zach, how much do you know about this building? Huh? Didn't you ask me the same thing before? I did, but... The people in this building. I was wondering how much you know about them. Huh? You guys here? No, the guy's here. Ugh. I noticed they're all creepy as fuck. Really? I never really hung around on other floors in the first place, except for moving between floors. Sure, they'd show themselves to me once in a blue moon, but they're all fucking crazy. Not the kind of, not the kind you have a chit chat with. Crazy. So, did you ever get the urge to kill them? Huh? Never mind. Okay, let's look elsewhere. Yep. This looks like the only way to go. I greatly fear for our safety. There's no freaking point in war to worry about what uh, that bullshit now is there. I just can't talk anymore.
Hey, I'm talking to you. Zach, you should consider what I'm saying. Open the door and step through. Uh-oh. I suspected as much. Shit! Well, it doesn't surprise me more than it would... Then it would be locked. Look. The keys on the desk require safe key. The box is tightly shut, it has no keyhole, and it appears to have some sort of lock mechanism. The safe is locked. Inventory. Safe key. This key's not meant for here. If it's not meant for here, there's no point messing around with it. Inventory. Safe key. The safe is unlocked. The safe contains what appears to be a single remote control. Required remote control. A remote control. Hey, is that all? Uh huh. What the hell? That safe's as big as me, and that's all that was in there? A big ass safe with nothing worthwhile inside. It's like oversized garbage from hell. Is warped and shut tight. There's nothing inside it. There are everyday items inside. A cluster of televisions is installed on the wall. We're gonna save this. Inventory. Remote control. Use it. How's everyone doing? This is a video for all you sinners out there. Allow me to clue you in as to what is going on. The death trap in this room is designed with an extravagant twist. It features an airtight interior to ensure no air leaks outside. Naturally, the room comes complete with reinforced glass windows. Go on, just try to break them. Permeating the interior is something wonderful indeed. This lovely feature will also gently coat the sinners' lungs in toxic death. Have you guessed it yet? That's right, deluxe poison gas! Oh yes, that's not to say there isn't a means of escape. Out of the mercy of my heart, I've prepared not two, but one shoddy gas mask that's so old, it could crumble away in your hands at any moment. Good luck escaping before your mask breaks. Filling your poor pair of lungs with toxic poison. Have fun and be sure to breathe sparingly. Don't take this personally. Run away, a convict and alluring sinner. Just be sure to go ahead and let the gas do its job if you fail to dazzle me, oh, okay? Ah, I almost forgot. Should you bore me by taking too long to meet your maker, keep in mind there's a time limit. Go over the time limit and there's an extra special gift in store for you. Extra potent super deluxe poison gas! Check the TV to keep tabs on the time limit, okay? Alright, in just a few seconds it'll be time to unleash the gas. I hope you have a fantastic time! Hey, what's the plan? Her explanation said there's a way to escape. I'll do everything in my power to find how to escape. At any rate, let's hurry and put on the gas mask. Hey, I gotta put this on? Yeah, the cord makes it so it can't be moved from here. Whoever is searching the room can't use it, so go ahead and use it for now. Gotcha. But what happens if you die? We'll find out. We'll find out? Cut the crap! If you die now, I'll be stuck here. Figure it out. Okay, how's this? I'll go take a look around for a bit and then come and switch places with you. Fine, let's be it's better than dying on me. Nothing inside the box. Nothing inside the box. There's a shabby mattress. I can see something deep inside of an incision, but I can't reach it. I can probably reach it if I make more incisions. That's marked to the top of the wall. But the marks are too high to see where they go. The door is warped and shut tight. There's nothing inside. There's something on the top of the shelf, but it's out of reach. There's a, there are everyday items inside. 
with the abuse. Quite scissors. Is there anything we can do with the scissors? All that's left is on top of the shelf, but it's out of reach. Set the matches up. I'll try to make this mattress with these scissors. Found a key in the mattress. Acquired a key. The safe is locked. Inventory. Wire. Wire was decided to say acquired the wire. What can I use this for? The dark red stain. Stain human sheets object lies on the floor. Move it. It's heavy. It's stuck to the floor and too much for me to move on my own. Something's right on the floor. Men with unsightly legs. The men who lay here are spineless, murderous fools who tread on life with their own legs. Realizing their sin, they began to suffer, yet they could not abandon those legs. The foolish sinners had no choice but to use those two legs to wander through hell for all eternity. Talk. Hurry up! This mask is getting on my nerves. It's hard to talk in reeks of dust. So make a point not to talk to me. Got it? Talk. Ah, what? Can you breathe in that thing? For fuck's sake, can't you tell by looking at me? If I couldn't, then I wouldn't be here talking to you. Duh! The box is tightly shut. It has no keyhole and it appears to have some sort of lock mechanism. There's a pair of scales. Mark, there's like something on the wall. Wall's cake looks good. I can't get it off with my hands. This is some seriously stubborn dirt. Is there something I can use to remove the dirt? The rake's filthy. It's not even fit for cleaning. Damn this mask reeks. It smells like shit when I talk. Gak! Try not to throw up in the mask. Fuck off! What's the point of wearing this thing anyway? Filters the gas so you don't inhale the poison. Huh? The way you said it doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Can't move it. Take a look at it. The message is written on the floor next to what resembles an index finger. So up, left, up, left, up, right. This is some sort of execution sequence. Left, down, right, down, right, down. The gas is wearing on me. And I'm stuck anyways. Maybe I can ask him to take over searching for a bit. Okay guys. We're gonna call it quits here, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe for more content from yours truly, and as always, I will see you all next time. Bye bye